Turn on six, one, two, three, four, four five, six. Hey. How has this school year been different from the others? Masks. <laughs> Hybrid. Uh, dividers. It's very hard to Focus. see. Yeah. Oh, contact tracing. Oh, oh my god. Yeah. I miss seeing people's faces. I feel like it's harder to like connect with people because of the mask and like the things like that. Like people are like more isolated. We should do everything we we can, but what a mask it's just on. restrictions, and I can't breathe within this with this mask on. So my entire year was online, so, so half the school is in here. Yeah, yeah. which is kind of nice. Yeah. <laughs> it's good with like lunchtime though, because like not everyone is crowded. Mm -hmm. Online learning in the beginning of the year that was a big change. Mm -hmm. It was nice while it lasted for sure. Uh, yeah, I don't really think I've even seen like my teachers even really know what I look like. They just see my sixth grade picture. Not having double block classes was actually nice. Shorter was, classes. Yeah, that was nice. not having to Definitely. Be for an hour and a half. That yes. was great. Okay, next question. What is your biggest success during high school? I guess my biggest success, uh, getting in the National Honor Society. That was a, an, a really good achievement. And you also got in. Yeah, th yeah, that's my biggest success as well. Oh, passing uh, Ms. Kern's uh, world history test. AP, yeah. I think for all of us, like getting into college is pretty cool. Oh, yeah. So. <laughs> Making the next step um, towards our future. She is so it's really exciting. <laughs> Rachel got all A's. I got all A's all high school. Sydney, what's your biggest success? Yeah, you know. um, getting a five on AP Calc. Oh. Making friends with all of them. Yeah. Oh, oh that's you're really so sweet. sweet. You're so oh. sentimental. Wow. Oh. Oh. I'm not even lying. Oh. Oh. I hit the heart. Getting nine letters for varsity sports. Yeah. Yeah. Graduating. Yeah. To graduate. <laughs> you know what I'm Pick that boy Carson Beck off. Mm -hmm. hey. Going to regionals for basketball. <laughs> yeah, going to regionals for basketball. The girls' basketball team went to regionals for the first time ever. And we went to the district championship. We didn't win, but we did go. I think taking top four in conference wrestling with a dislocated shoulder was pretty cool. Are you to make it about yourself? <laughs> The question is about me. Actually, that might be the biggest success. Make it to the oh, playoffs. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Because yeah. that playoff first time, round three, all together, together, yeah. yeah. No, we spat. Hey, that was turnt, though. Yeah. Yeah. That was the best yeah. feeling I've ever felt. Smash some boys' fleshes, sit them boy back to the beach. Oh, yeah. that was the best With game. Stop playing. We was turnt. Hey. Go watch the highlight, you know what I'm saying? Link Please the roll them below. back. Run, that was roll the clip, roll the clip. Tally home. Tally oh, thought it was Tally come Lincoln. Come on, bro. Yeah. How you come from Tally and lose, man? Yeah. yeah. All the way oh, had to make that oh. draw, you know? Then in the second half, we're down 9-7. to seven, But check out the concentration from J5, Jordan Smith. Take another look as the pass gets tipped and right into the waiting hands of Jordan Smith. Defense was the name of the game on Friday night. Elijah Raspberry ends it for the Stingrays, who go on to win 17 to nine. We just sitting at home, man. We just sitting at home, man. We ain't hearing none of that. Are you ready? Probably not. Can you tell me the definition of a Karen? A Karen? Isn't that a mean lady, the ones 
Speak to the manager. A person that cares deeply about her own idealistic thoughts on how society should work and is self-centered in the way that she perceives it. Uh, yeah, sure. You know what, you know what a, a group of Karen's called? A homeowner's association. Sounds about right, yeah. Okay, can you tell us the definition of bussin'? Of what? Bussin'? Uh, we bust into school, yo. Bet. Bussin', like that food, bussin'. Oh, it's good, it's really good. What about hits different? This food hits different. And it tastes terrible. What about built different? Built different? One more time? Built different, I'm built different. Raspberry. <laughs> God created like individuality and so we're all able to kind of like be built differently. Uh, I guess. <laughs> Can you tell me the definition of a simp? A simp? I'm a simp for my boyfriend. You got clothes to your boyfriend? <laughs> no. What about teed? At prom, we're going to be teed. Teed? Yeah, we're teed. Does that got something to do with dancing? <laughs> what we're does teed. teed do? Gossip? Gossip. No! no. <laughs> <laughs> you want to do it? No, not last time no more. Yes, okay, look, well, we'll, tell you we'll give you the list of words, but I'm not telling you which ones I'm picking. <laughs> All right, last one. What's the definition of purr? Is that the, the sound the cat make when they are relaxed? Mm, no habla English. <laughs> what will you miss the most about Atlantic Coast? The sunrises in the morning. The, the palm trees. 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 Definitely sure. like the teachers. And it just feels weird that I'm not gonna be able to see the teachers anymore. And it's like, mm. I don't really know. Weird. And like you see them out in public, and you're just like, oh, I know you. Hi. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I had you. We're gonna be freshmen again in college. Oh. Uh, the fun. whole growing up thing. No. Gross. Yeah, growing up. I'm gonna miss seeing the service dog every oh, single day. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna miss you, Miss Newman, and okay. uh, the lunch ladies. Definitely my main girls. Oh. I'm going to miss Mr. R's enthusiasm. Skirt, skirt. Mm -hmm. Tommy Rock is here. Sandman is back. Kush Cam's live to crush a dope track. Tommy Rock and the Sandman rocking with the Kush Cam. Hey, yo, it's really that time. Is it picking me up on the mic? Do you want me to hold it like a rapper, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Class of 2021, we love you guys. You are the best. Gonna miss you like you're gonna miss me, but we'll always be together. Ross out. I'll always be there for you if you need help or anything. For the ones I like. For the ones I don't like, don't bother me. All right? Anyway, good luck, guys. Have a great rest of your life. Who's your favorite teacher and why? I'd say Mr. Rowan. He's, um, he's chill and laid back. What's up, Stingrays? Uh, on behalf of the teachers and admin at Atlantic Coast High School, we just like to say good luck. Uh, we wish you the best of luck on all your endeavors after high school. Don't be strangers. Come by and visit us anytime. And uh, we'll miss you and we'll love you. Bye. Till we see each other again, love you and miss you always. Mr. R. He's Mr. Green. Kushner, that boy Chad. Shout out Ms. Newman. Hello, seniors. My favorite teacher would probably be Ms. Newman just because she's been there for me and I've had her for two years. I just wanted to take a second to say how proud I am of you and all of your hard work. I shout out Ms. Newman because uh, that's my dog too. Ms. Newman makes everything fun. I sincerely, I love you guys. I hope you have an amazing college experience. Really cherish it. Study abroad if you can. If you can't, Travel as much as possible. Shout out Mr. Sands, that's my boy. Hey seniors, it's Mr. Sands. Just wanted to give you a quick shout out, uh, a goodbye if you will. Maybe one last price don't shift the curve for the road. Just remember that one. M Mrs. That's my, Sands too, that, oh. Mr. and Mrs. Both of them. This year is, is definitely for me the best group I've ever had. Um, so you guys are not students to me, your family. Um, I'm gonna miss you. I'm always here if you ever need me. Uh, reach out, come see me, come back. Um, Stingrays forever. I love you guys. My yes. personal favorite has to be Miss Sands. Oh, yes. Yes. Miss Sands, I love Miss Sands.
Miss Sands. I love Miss Sands. We are her first graduate because she came our yeah. freshman year. So you're my ninth graders, my babies, and I'm so proud of you. Miss Sands, you are amazing. And for you are our first teacher. You were my first teacher ever in high school because you're my first period and you were just awesome. And I love you. I remember everything about you, even your handwriting. I will never forget you and I will be here for you forever. I, I love you. She did like scare me my very No, first she scared day, me though. so much. She, she was like, she was like, she was like welcome to high school. We're gonna start working. Yeah. I was like, whoa. Well, she know, definitely though. scared yeah. me too. No, you took me to Universal and for that I'll always love you. Oh yes, yes. we all appreciate so that true. so much. So if you ever, ever need me, you know how to get in touch with me. Once you're my student, you are always my student. I wish you the very, very best. I love you. Mrs. Sands. One of my favorite teachers is Mr. Thompson because he's kind of like really open to everybody and he's yeah. like knows, he like gives off the vibes where he's open up to where you can go and talk to him about anything. Zamudio. Best. Yeah. Favorite. He's amazing. Estudiantes de la clase 2021, les deseo lo mejor. Un futuro bueno y lleno de buenos sucesos y que tengan una buena, buena temporada en la universidad. Gracias y hasta luego. Miss Shorter. Hi, Miss Shorter. Miss Shorter. 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 Oh, Thank yeah. you I so much. Literally, go. I would get, love her. I would get excited to get up in the morning and go to her class because yes. it was yes. just Ms. so Shorter, fun. I loved that and class. Class was like, awesome. Had this energy in her room that was I'm just like me. so nice to be in. So yeah, yeah. shout out to Miss Shorter. I'm uh, she was so encouraging. Honors biology yeah. was the best with you. Hey guys, congratulations on graduating. I'm so proud of you all. First period bio from four years ago. Never forget what happened. Wink, wink. And make sure you guys follow me on TikTok. We'll work for heels. Oh, Mr. Kent. What's up, guys? I really love Oh, you. Mr. Oh, Kent. Yeah. Iconic. You're probably the favorite class I've ever taught. We had him for two years. Overall, that class you. was just the best. You guys just, I don't know if you just caught me at a spurt, uh, certain time, but it was just always really fun to teach you guys. All the class discussions that we had for the kids that had me were some of the best that I'd ever had. And I also just really like you guys as people. Thank you for letting me do cartwheels throughout your classroom. I really like you guys. I love you guys. Um, I'm excited to see what you guys do. Congratulations on finishing high school. I think that doing this in the middle of COVID and everything like that is, even more impressive. Uh, you guys handled it really well. I'm sorry that this happened while you guys were here. Um, I'm sorry that your last couple years were kind of, you know, uh, waylaid by this thing a little bit. But um, yeah, I just, I love you guys and I just wish you guys all the best. Shout out Ms. Y. Oh yeah, yeah Ms. Y. Ms. Y, because if I didn't take, if I didn't have her as a teacher, I probably wouldn't have graduated this year. Ms. Sharma. I know we won't be seeing much of each other, so I wanted to say goodbye. I believe in each and every one of you. I hope all of you do well and change the world in some way or the other. We'll miss you. Bye. Miss Solomon has done a lot for us. She, she has, has done, done so much. Honestly, shout out Miss Curran, Loki. Loki. No, not Loki. Mr. Frenzel. Mr. Frenzel. I keep coming back to his class because I just know that he challenges me every day. Yeah. I really mm -hmm. love him as a teacher. And he's not, a really great teacher. Yeah. And it's not just that he'll challenge you, but he's able to like help you. And like if he explains something, I actually get it. Hey, class of 2021. Um, congratulations. We wish you all the best. You've worked really hard. And good luck for all the you do in the future. Congratulations again. I just want you to know that always follow your heart and your dreams and what you desire and as long as it feels like it's the right path for you, you're going to be fine. Did anyone have Miss James? No. Yes, Miss James. James. Shout out to Miss James. She was so awesome. She would always dance in the morning and um, I miss you so much. You were always so kind and oh, I just miss her so much. What do you remember about your first day at Atlantic Coast? Probably gym class. Yeah, we had we had gym class together. That was a fun class. I remember the picture that we took. I should send it to Kushner. <laughs> <laughs> I remember my first day being super scared. I had to run locker. Really sweaty, really <laughs> clammy. Like, I just was terrified. My first day of high school, I missed the bus. My first day at AC was sophomore year. 
and that was the first time I've ever ridden the bus. <laughs> Not gonna lie, I was pretty frantic. <laughs> frantic? <laughs> I remember walking in and there being so many people. I'm glad y'all knew people. I, w I came straight out of homeschool, so. Oh yeah, yeah. I went Same six year. years without Private hanging school. out with anybody, and then you're just in public school, surrounded by Thrown thousands in. of people. So the three of us. Yes, yes. Came yes. Out from virtual the homeschooled, homeschooled people. Mm -hmm. It was rough. I remember being really excited that we could eat outside. Like I just thought that was so really? cool that we were allowed to eat outside. My first day, I went to lunch and I was so scared because I'd never been to public school and I didn't know anyone. And I sat with a group of seniors. <laughs> no. no, I sat by they myself. Were nice. so. They were super nice though. But okay. they were like, really how old are you? Like, what are your thoughts on being an all girls team? It's it's basically just a movement. I mean, feminism, feminism girls being girls. Like I mean, we're. The best out here, that's all I can say. What's your game plan for winning the competition today? Uh, we're probably just gonna like take the dub, really. That's our game plan. How do you feel about the competition today? Easy, easy money. What is y'all's mindset going into today's competition? W's. Win. Try not to fall. Okay, here we are at our first event of the day. We have a crab walking relay. This will set the tone for the games completely. Turn around, turn around! Woo! How do we feel about winning first place? Uh, I feel great, you know? Took a lot of hard work, dedication, you know? A lot of focus, yeah. Yes, sir. Oh my God! Let's just say that. Let's leave it at that. Leave it at that. Oh. Eddie, get your legs in the ground. Eddie, fall. Did great. We won easy landslide victory. Honestly, a whole lot of talk, not a lot of show. I don't know. <laughs> okay. Uh, 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 we don't interview losers. I'm sorry. Let's get some good throws, Kelsey. Let's get some good throws. Focus. Yes, you can. Yes. Oh. A Candice here is about to start around the world. How are you feeling? I'm pretty confident, honestly. Competition. Good matchup here against Fembots and Candace. Let's see who wins. Get back! Get back! Get back! Oh! A slide finish! Wow! Let's go! This way! This way! This way! Very intense game. Gonna come down to the wire, the last two people. Yeah, that was a much needed win. Uh, I think that puts us at 4-1 now, so we're in a good spot for the rest of the game. What was your favorite part of the Senior Olympics? One of our teammates, uh, Movika, she got hurt on the first obstacle course. Like, Whole toenail gone. Like ripped off, <laughs> it was bloody. Anyway, and then like the next thing, we had an obstacle course again. She freaking did it, and not only did she do it, we Came won. Clutch. We won! Literally. She was like right there, and she like, it was amazing. So. Beat the Fembots, and we won that whole challenge. I know, it was good. Can we see the bloopers we from this? Yeah. It'll They're take me a little bit of time okay. to sort okay. through, but I'll definitely include bloopers yes. with your group and everyone else. Oh, okay. Okay. Very cool. Okay, cool. What is your biggest success during high school? I'd say my biggest success. <laughs> <laughs> block that out, Kush. <laughs> okay, if you're gonna edit this footage, okay. cut looks like right here. There's just gonna be so many cuts in this video. Yeah. Should we run it back? No. no. Hey, turn that off and do it again. I feel so bad for whoever's editing uh, this. It's questionable. How is he gonna edit all this? Can he edit it? Yes. Yeah. He's not gonna watch this entire thing. Again? This is a dumb question. question. Yeah, I don't like that question. Mr. Kushner, I don't think it's dumb. He's gonna accept yeah, that. A lot of questions. I just don't think it's a good question for the interview, respectfully. What do you remember about your first day of Atlanta? Wait, time out. She's on a phone call. <laughs>
<laughs> sorry. You didn't want to like alert us? <laughs> sorry guys, I'm on the phone with Nevins. Can you say that one more time? Oh my god. Yeah. Can you tell them we're busy? Uh-huh. Okay. Why did you okay, do it? Sorry for that intermission. Go ahead. Can we talk about that concert? Oh my god. Oh, that, that, was, yeah, that was, was so, so cool. Fun. Was so I fun. love that. The that concert. was cool. This is where you put in the crickets, yeah. Mr. Yeah, Kushner. Yeah, yeah. Crickets in the background. <laughs> Hasn't been a lot of good music. I think you have to speak a little louder. Yeah, why are you all sitting close? Speak into the mic. Okay. Whoa. Um, Anything on Polo G's album and pretty much any new Lil Durk song. And, and we have Trevor Lawrence now. Oh, we're, we're Trevor Lawrence! <laughs> Baby, we got Trevor Lawrence! Show us your tweet out! We got Ida Myatt! 10 feet on my car! Super Bowl 2021! Yeah. We're gonna do it! We're gonna do it! Alright, ready? 3, okay, 2, two one. 1. Do it! Alright, well, that's perfect timing because it's 8.01 and the bell's gonna ring any second. Well, I think the bell just rang. Did it? Oh! oh. Yay! Yeah. Okay. We haven't even, uh, we got to the end. Are we done? No, I don't think No, we're not okay. done. Go see Grace!